Hi everyone. I'm Diane with Mimi's Life and I have a Timu haul for you today. Oh, I didn't feel like doing a haul today. I have been under the weather again. I tell you, the cold, this cold and flu or whatever season that we've been dealing with, I have gone through it so many more times this year than I have ever in my whole life. Like, it's been really warm here. One day we was up to like 86. And then yesterday was uh, high in the 70s. And then today it's 50 degrees. And it's supposed to be low in the 40s tonight. And then tomorrow it's supposed to be cool. And then the next day it's supposed to be back up to like high 70s. So... I'm thinking that's why everybody's getting sick. It keeps blowing stuff in or something. I don't know. But all of the kids' allergies have been acting up. And I guess I'm going to spend the first five minutes talking about all my illnesses. <laughs> I won't do that to you. But um, how has everybody been? I haven't seen you all in a few days. So I thought I'd get on here. It's been just calling my name. Timu, Timu, get your haul then, Diane. So, my ring light, I guess, just finally pootered out because I can't get it to come on. And I don't know what's wrong with it. But I think it's light enough in here in my room not to have it. It's pretty light in here. So, I'm just going to get right into this haul because i got quite a few bags. So, oh, first thing I want to talk to you all about is... The new sweaters that I've gotten, you know, a few of, and i got more coming in, those really paper-thin sweaters, like I have the one with the Easter bunnies on it, or not Easter bunnies, but bunnies, it looks like graffiti, and um, I've washed them a couple of times, and they've washed up great. Last time I washed them, I'm going to show y'all sh what it did. It's this one, the one that, this was my favorite one, too. I washed it. This just came apart like that. Look at that. I went to put it on. There's a little hole right there and just a big, it's like it just all came apart. Like, what would even cause that? It just raveled out. And I'm like, oh no. And I really like this one a whole lot. It's the one with the clock on it. So, should I tell them about it or throw it away? I don't know. So, yeah, I was bummed out about that. Well, my next thing I got, I got me some of these metal signs for my kitchen. Because... You know, my kitchen, y'all have seen it. It looks kind of, uh, kind of farmhousey, kind of looking. And, um, so I got this new sign I thought was super cute. It, uh, I didn't take it out of the paper, but I think y'all can see it fine. But it's tin. It's one of those tin signs. And thank goodness it didn't come in all jacked up, like bent up and stuff. So... There's a few things that I want to pull down out of the kitchen and put these up. I thought they were really cute. I wish the holes were a little bit, tad bit bigger on them. So, it's about as big as, well, I don't know. A teeny tiny nail would go in. But I got that one. And I got this one. Remember that packaging? I thought this was really cool. It looks like an old sign. I like it a whole lot. So, got that one. Didn't write the prices down today. I don't have any other prices wrote down. I guess I could have done that for y'all. I didn't, wasn't even thinking about it. Um, and I got this one. I thought this one was cool. Well, they got the deal right there in the middle. Wanted to do it. Go ahead and get up, show y'all all this stuff so I can get all my stuff put up. 
So that's what that one looks like. It's pretty cute. I got those three. Three. And I got a couple more coming. I got this little thing. Got my scissors. This little thing here to put on the sink. It's one of those where you just wrap it around your, um, you know, your little faucet on the kitchen sink. I hope it fits mine. I don't know if it'll fit mine or not. I don't know if I have like the long deal. I can't remember. Or if it's just an, I don't know. I hope it does. Anyway, it's really cute. I think my last haul, it might be this haul, I got some, um, some kitchen towels to match. And this, I don't remember what's in this. Let me open this up. <clears throat> oh, it's these glasses. These glasses that you use are, you know, I think this is a no on these because, you know, it's the glasses where it has the, you know, like this on this side, like whenever you're putting on your makeup. I can't, I can't really, I can't read anything out of it. Let me put it on this side. No, these are not good at all. They're super cheap. They're real, just thin, thin plastic. Nothing to them. So, I would say a no on that. <coughs> I got some more of these because I know the price on these. I got them, I, uh, they were like a flash deal or whatever, and they were 69 cents. So, I got three more of these, either for me or the girls or whoever. You know, you can put all kinds of stuff in these. Nails, um, screws. <coughs> Can't get that off my hand. <coughs> Nails, screws, rings, whatever on these. Tacks. So I got three of them for me and the girls. <coughs> And I got I got a card, but it's not very appropriate, so I don't think that I will read it. Um, I got it for my husband. I better not read it. It says, you know, um, happy birthday, you old fart. Uh, Try not to, try not to poop when you blow out the candles. It's not very nice. <laughs> it's not a very nice card, but my husband will think it's funny. Oh, and I got this one. i seen, um, Aaron got these a few times. This, uh, happy 29th birthday from your 110 pound friend. <laughs> this is funny. I'm going to give it to the other grandma. Well, I hope she's not watching. So, I'm going to give it to her. Got that. Oh, yeah. I got this sign in this one, too. I thought this was really cute. I got a, a, a coffee sign where my coffee bar is in the kitchen. But, oh, no. This little thing came off. Darn. Let me grab this screw. I thought this one was really cute. But the little thing on the back came off. So here's the screw and all that. I'll put it over here. My husband will fix it. He sees a lot better than I do. So, but isn't that cute? I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger. But I think it's going to look really cute where I'm going to put it. I got that. Okay. 
Can y'all believe that it's fixing to be the first of March already? Man, this year is flying by, isn't it? I got two of these for Sadie because it's um, another one of these little like retro little kit deals. It comes with a pair of glasses, little retro glasses with the little stones on them right there. I don't know if y'all can see them or not, but that, and it comes with a pair of uh, little pink earrings. Oh, the earrings are cute. Comes with the little pink pair of earrings, which she can't even tell that they're pink. Comes with that. And this is kind of a funky color pink, but comes with a pink wrap for your hair. I wish I could wear these. Like, I know I would look terrible in this. No, I can't do anything on my head. A hat, a band, nothing. Nothing looks right on my head. I wish I could. These people look so cute in hats and in headbands. And, <coughs> and it comes with this. And I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a scarf. It's a scarf around the neck. This is cute. Some have gloves. You know, some have different things. I was going to open it to see what the scarf looked like. There it goes. It's just a pink scarf. You can put it on your head or put it around your neck. Like this. That's so cute. I got to order her another dress. She told me, <clears throat> she gave me full range to pick her out two more of these retro dresses so I'm gonna pick her out two more and this is the black um, she has the red the red kit you know that she wore with that other dress that I got her oh this comes with a pair of sunglasses this one's really cute comes with the pair of like cat eye sunglasses those are cute. And then it comes with a pair of glasses. Oh, wait, you know it. Just Jen. She wears um, the cat eye glasses and she looks so cute in them I love her channel if y'all don't um, watch Jess Jen y'all go over there and check her out she's she's so she's so pretty and she's she buys some really cool stuff I'm always jumping on there and snagging stuff that she buys because I love the way the style of how she decorates her house is a lot like I decorate mine so I like it a whole lot. <clears throat> These come with some little studs like that, polka dot earrings. This one, this this little set is really cute. It comes with a whole lot more in this one. This is another black scarf to uh, put around your neck or whatever. Of course, it came with a much better band. I like these because it has a wire in there and it really holds up to your hair a whole lot better. She's got thick hair. So, and it comes with a pair of gloves in this one. So this one's really cute. Came with two pair of glasses, a scarf, a headband, um, and a pair of earrings. So, and these were like $5. These little sets like this are like five dollars. So she really likes wearing this kind of stuff. 
so that's that. And I got this. It is, um, I don't know when I'll ever use this thing. Like, but it's supposed to be for like a salad. My gosh, I'm trying not to rattle this so bad. It's supposed to be for like a salad. I think you put like your dressing there. And then, um, yeah, let me put on my glasses and see. Oh, yeah, and it's got a little handle that you can put on here. Comes with a little handle. Two-way vessel, two-layer salad cup. Hmm. You put the little deal right there. Put that on there. And then this here is just where you put your... Uh-oh, I dropped that. Put your salad dressing. You put your salad dressing there and put your salad in here. I doing guys oh duh that's why um Angela over at uh, material mom she said we need a table to set a table down in front of us so we can put this stuff up here and we can demonstrate it better and I totally agree with her I wished I had a table you know what I could buy though I could buy one of those like um those bedside tables that sometimes you see them at the thrift store and stuff that you can wheel away from your bed that would be pretty cool that I could just sit right here and I could break it down when I got done and put it away because I really don't have anywhere to put a desk in my room my room's not big enough I have my furniture and stuff's too big but I would really like to have one where it would you know just sit right here where I could really show this stuff you know and then I think it would be so much better too so Angela yeah I agree with you 100% so I don't know what's in this it's another little package Let's see what's in here oh I shouldn't have cut that open like that these are those I don't know how this works these are those strips that you put on your carpet to keep them from sliding all over the floor. That's sticky on that side. I was going to see what this side was if you pulled this side off. They're just both sticky on both sides. <clears throat> now tell me if I'm wrong. <clears throat> if that's both sticky on both sides, what's going to keep from a whole lot of dirt sticking to this sticky side and then it not working anymore? Wouldn't y'all think? I don't know. Try them. whole bunch of them come in here. I don't know how many whole bunch of them so I'm gonna try it matter of fact I got a rug in this one one of those spongy rugs that slide all over the place so we'll see how that works I'll let you know I was gonna bring something in here and um, let me grab let me empty this grab this so I can put the trash in this thing I was gonna bring in here um that can opener that I that I hauled a while back. Remember that? Let me put this down just a tad bit. Remember that red um, that red can opener that I hauled um, a while back? It was the one that you just put on the lid and you just push the button and it just goes around it, you know, and and it's got batteries in it or whatever. Do not get that that 
we tried to open one can. It took my husband forever to get one can open, and it never worked again after that. Like, we even replaced the batteries, and it's just a piece of poop. That is a no on that. Or, if y'all have one, and y'all's work, y'all tell me, maybe I just got a bad one. I don't know. But ours doesn't work worth a flip. So, that wasn't a very good deal. I got this ring for to put in my giveaway box and look how it came it just poked right through there so I'm just gonna go ahead and open it and put it in another little another little deal but it's um, it's like that it's the moon and the star or whatever and I think it's adjustable but that's what it looks like. And I'm going to put this in my giveaway stuff. So, I'll need to keep another little, another little baggie for that. So I can put that in there. Okay, I got this. That I don't know what it is. Oh, yes I do. I needed one of these. This is just a, a hook. A plastic hook that um, for a wreath for the front door I have one an autumn one and it has like an autumn leaf on it and then I have a Christmas one that has something Christmassy on oh it says joy but I just needed a plain Jane one now, I don't know this is plastic so mine are metal we'll see we'll see how well this this works. I should have bought one at the Dollar Tree when they have them. They have them like in seasonal weather. So, we'll see. It was cheap, like a dollar. So, I needed that. I needed that to put up. I need to put my um, Easter wreath together now that it's fixing to be March. Here's another ring that I got from my giveaway box. It's a size 8. Guys, I, even, I went down <coughs> at my um, Dollar General and they had some, this is cute, that's really cute, it's not very, focusing very good, but, yeah, that's cute, so this is something for my giveaway box, but, um, I went down to the Dollar General and they were, they had the, got their truck in. So, um, the boy in there let me get some boxes, you know, just some pretty good size <clears throat> little boxes so I can have them for my giveaways. So, and then I went down to the Dollar Tree and got my paper and all my stuff to wrap everything up to get them sent off. So, I have everything now. I just need to put them together and announce it and send them off. Pick some names and send them off. So, I'm getting it all together, guys. So, I'm fixing to have my, um, I, I, now, thanks to y'all, I mean, I have to thank y'all, um, for, I'm, I'm way past 5,000 now. I'm like 5,500 or something like that. And thank y'all so much. Like, I can't even believe that I'm up that high. Like, that's wild to me. It's crazy. So, um, I appreciate y'all so much. Y'all, y'all have been so kind, so kind to me. And I just love doing what I'm doing. And I love all y'all's comments and and meeting new friends and just it's awesome. Y'all are awesome. So yeah, thank y'all, thank y'all. So I was thinking since I've accumulated so much stuff, you know, I really should put five boxes together. Five small boxes I mean not huge like the, my one big giveaway that I have that huge box you know that I gave away but you know five small boxes of just 
tons of stuff that I've gathered up around here and to show y'all how much I appreciate y'all. I want to show y'all how much I appreciate y'all by giving back. So, yeah, I'm going to get my boxes together and we're going to do that. Um, I'm going to try to get it all together by this weekend. So, anyway, back to the haul. That's a ring for my giveaway. Um, this here, I'm going to put my glasses back on. This here is a it's just a white little makeup deal that Tara likes to use. I don't know what that name is. But, oh. I was going to open it. If I can. It's got more plastic on it. I'm the worst at getting into these packages. There it goes. I should have twisted it to begin with. It sticks on my fingers and I can't get it off. So, see it's just white. Oh, it hardly shows anything. Well, it looks a little bit better. But, yeah, she likes to take it and just put it in the corners of her eye. She likes to use it like that. It just took my picture, like, snapped my picture, so that's probably going to be a thumbnail. It's going to look like poop. So, got that for her. Here's a little brooch that I got, um... To put in my giveaway it's just a little bird but isn't it cute I don't know if it's me or if it's my camera or what but everything looks blurry to me I'm hoping that it doesn't look so bad to y'all guys I got that to go in my giveaway stuff And <clears throat> here's another little ring. And they covered up the sides on this. It's an eight. Since I've gained weight, my fingers has gotten bigger. Some of my rings I can't even wear. So this is a size eight. And let me see what finger it'll fit on. No. It's just a blue, it's a real pretty blue ring. And it's um, another little piece of jewelry that I'm putting in my giveaway box. So a lot of stuff that I've been getting, oh I have a really cool um, giveaway in this somewhere that I'm going to put in one of <clears throat> my giveaway boxes. So that's that. And here is, I got two of these, so I'll just open it up and, and let y'all see one of them. Because one of them is mine and one of them is for the giveaway. It's just a little, um, little key deal that goes on your keychain. Just a little pretty, little pretty thing and it's got this little deal. Where do you put that at? I guess just in right here. Just put it in right there. Like that. So, yeah, isn't that cute? So I'm going to keep this one. And then I got a pink one to put in my giveaway. And here is just a little... Um, spongy deal that will go into the giveaway. I don't want to open this one. So it's just a little scrunchy deal for the shower. So that's that so far. 
dump out this bag. I've got so many of these bags. Um, I just keep on saving them, thinking that if anybody needs any, I would send them to them. This shirt here came in, and I really love the material. Um, it's a button-up. I'm not going to try this on because it is so super wrinkled. You wouldn't be able to tell what it looked like. Um, but it it's not that, um, like, scarf material. It feels like, um, almost like linen. But it's, I don't even know if y'all can tell the material that it is. But it's not shiny. And it's really soft super cute. I like it a whole lot. It just has these little birds all over it. But on the back side, it is made like this. It's gathered in the back. If y'all can tell. So, I think it's going to be super cute. If I do get it pressed and everything, laundried and pressed or whatever, I hope I don't have to iron it because I hate to iron. So, but if I have to, I will. I actually bought the steamer deal where you just hang it up and steam it, and I've never used it yet. So, that might be a good thing I can check it out on. So, I got um, these pair of pajamas because they were $4 and something on one of those flash deals, so I got it. And it's just a bunch of cats on a, um, it's really, really soft, thin, um, material. The shirt doesn't look very long, but it don't matter. It's just the sleep in. So, it's like five dollars. And y'all know how I love pajamas. So, in here, it's long pants. And there's the pants to it. So, either me or the... Or one of the kids to get it. It'll match Sadie's house shoes that I got for her. I got her some um, <clears throat> cat house shoes. I'm going to throw it all over there because i all got to be washed. So, I got this shirt. It is, it's really soft. Super soft. Hope y'all don't mind that I'm not trying on today. But, um... It's really long. It's an extra large. And it's the really soft one. Like, I love this material on these shirts. I wish all of them were made like this. So, and of course, this feels... It don't even feel like too bad, you know? But it's a Fleetwood Mac. I really like those in my day. I like those guys. I still do. I love Stevie Nicks. So, um, got that. Oh, I got a video that I'm going to download for y'all with this outfit. This is an Elsa outfit that I got for the baby. It's just a little costume. And comes with, um, the little earrings. And it comes with, uh, the Elsa ponytail. Her wand. Let me put this on here. This is her crown. And this is her little necklace. She actually has some silk gloves, but I think she took them off somewhere. But anyway, here's the dress. Here's the dress. It's got a real long train on the back. But isn't that cute? She actually uh, let me, you know, she's a ham. So she let me film her singing in this dress. And I'll download that video and let y'all see it. But isn't that cute? So she played in it a day or two. I let her play in it whenever, she, whenever it came in. And she's done with it now, so this is going to be put up for um, Halloween. Unless she wants to play with it again, then she can play with it again. So, that's that. 
Oh, and I want to show y'all this. I got this from a coffee bar. Tell you what, my husband, we redid my kitchen. Um, we painted the cabinets. My cabinets used to be white. Painted the cabinets, and I used to have some wallpaper up in there. Took down the wallpaper, painted the kitchen white, put up um, some paneling backsplash, kind of like a farmhouse type paneling. Um, I'd have to show you, I don't know how to describe it. On the back, backsplash, and painted the kitchen white, did my cabinets in gray, and did my whole one countertop in like black granite type stuff. Well, I have this on the other side where my coffee bar is, I have this odd shaped. Um, count, <clears throat> countertop like a little bar deal and it's shaped kind of like an L so they didn't make that so we're going to have to have that special made so it's still green I hate it so much so I got this until we can have that thing special made to put in that area on top of that but in this nice it's rubber on the back it's just a like a mat and I think it's going to be the perfect size to go right there where you don't see that much of the green anymore so it smells like rubber it smells like a floor mat but yeah isn't that cute I liked it they have all different kinds like that so yeah I wanted it's like I need to get all my stuff out so I can get all this stuff put up and put away in the kitchen and get it out of the bedroom floor I hate that I could never be a a person that's just piles stuff up everywhere and you know what as I'm saying that I'm looking over it this way because I have two of those huge um, storage totes from Timu that are packed to the rim with summer clothes that don't fit me so you know I've got to do something with that because it's sitting over there and it's bugging the fire out of me okay I got these and um, these are the kitchen towels that I told you that I got for the kitchen that matches that rooster stuff These are really cute. That's that one. It's kind of that material like, I don't know, maybe not as bad as the dollar store. Maybe if I wash them, they won't, they'll feel better. I got a, a, um, a little towel rack deal coming. I don't know when it's coming, but I ordered one so I can put it on the outside of my cabinet because I don't really have anywhere to hang towels in there. So, and this is this one. I like this one better. But it's so cute. Um, they have a bunch of stuff in that. I'm throwing it over there so I can wash them. Um, this is Sadie's top. Oh, here's one of her little gloves. I need to put that in that sack. This is Sadie's top. Which I'm not fond of at all. But she, I mean, kids will be kids. I don't know. She wanted it really big. So it's a double X. And this is what it looks like. It's got really weird sleeves. Like look how long the sleeves are. So. And that's what it looks like. I'm sorry, it's just horrible. Ugh, I don't like it. But she does, so. And she don't watch my video, so she won't know I said that. Um, and here's another shirt I got. It's also Fleetwood Mac. I didn't really realize that I ordered two of Fleetwood Macs. So this one's soft, too. This one's a little bit more of that stretchier type of material. It's not as thin as that other one. But... This one's, this one's really cute, but whenever I 
pulled this out of the bag for the first time, this thing was stuck together just like that. And I was like, oh no, it's not going to come apart, but it did. So, this is really that kind of stuff, but I don't know. But that's that. I think it's pretty, the flowers. Okay, these. I got uh, these to go in my giveaway, one of my giveaway boxes. I got two sets of these. I ordered a black set, and then I seen the red set, and liked the red set better, so I ordered the red one. So I already have black and red, and I like them a lot. So I really love this color, so I got this color to go in my giveaway. So it's the salt and pepper shakers in this um, pretty blue color. So this will go into one of the giveaways. And guys, I'm just going to pack the boxes. I don't know what's going to go in what or who's going to get what or whatever. I'm just going to pack them and try to get equal amount, equal stuff in um, all of them. And um, like that. So this will go in one of them. Okay, so these are Layla's. Layla wanted these little cute headbands. Her hair is so thick, I don't know how well this is going to show up on her hair, but they're really pretty. It's just a little bitty headband with um, some butterflies with little bitty pearl, excuse me, pearls all over them. My camera is really not focusing at all. So, that's cute. See, it don't show up, but she's got really dark hair. So that's that one. And then she ordered um, this color. Oh no! Ah. You know when you hear somebody say that about teeny stuff, oh no, something's wrong. This just come off. This is what this one looks like. The little red roses with the pearls on it and this bow come right off on the top right there that's okay I can hot glue this it's just a pain in the neck you don't want to have to do it so darn but it fell off right you think that it would matter if that wasn't the, yeah it would so let me put this well, let me put it back in this little package so it doesn't lose that piece. I don't think they were very much like $2. So, what do you expect? So, and then she ordered these. She wanted these for her hair. And these are so cute. Um, it's little clips. And there's blue, purple, there's blue, purple, pink, and like a white color, and they're so cute. I need to get Abby some of these, and that's what they look like. They got a little stone in the middle of them, and they're just those little, little tiny clippies like that. So... See, I'm telling you, I can't put nothing on my head. Too old, I think. But anyway, that's those. Layla will be glad I did this because she's been wanting her stuff. This one here is Layla's. It's just another one of those um, little deals you put on your keys. Hers is like a light pink. So that's hers as well. And I don't remember what's in this. Oh, yeah. I got these for Sadie. This is a, a GRA card. And it's, um, it's the little earrings that, let me see, let me take it out.
it's just I don't remember I think it's like a 0 0.5 or something like that the size of it and on this end it's got the knob right there where you screw that ball on so it's got like a lock deal where you can screw them on the back she needs these for her second hole help her put those in tonight this morning I got up really early because she wanted me to straight iron her hair so I had to get up extra early and blow dry her hair so it wouldn't be so hard because she's got curly hair so I blow dried her hair and then straightened it out for her I got um, the watch bands in the right size this time so I do have some of these to go on my giveaway I think it's um this one's a 22 the other ones are 20 the size deal 20 but this is one of them the leopard print and this is the other print that I got this print here is really pretty it's just like neutral colors so I got those two watch bands for myself and what else guys oh no I'm at the end of my rope this is my last thing this went by quick didn't it wow so this is the rug I was telling y'all about that I got for the kitchen and I'm gonna check those things out and see how see how they work I'll let y'all know this is a big wow this is big I did not know this was that big that's huge I think I paid like $16 for this but I don't remember what size it was it's like this is really big I hope this works for me so it's that pattern it's that design that chicken design that's really nice. I really love this a whole lot. I just, it's foamy and I'm gonna lay it out at the end of my bed for a while and to get all of that out of it, the creases and stuff out. But super cute. All this stuff is gonna be real cute in the kitchen. I'll get it all put up and um, let y'all see all of it. I'm sorry about not trying here's her other glove trying the stuff on today I just not up to it even though I didn't have that much so uh, I had a, a notification come and oh, sometimes my, my bad knee the one that I need to re be replaced you know I had my my um, my right my right knee has been replaced and I need to replace my left knee well it locks up like if I'm sitting down too long and I go to stand up I can't stand up real fast because it feels like if I stand up it's just gonna crack right into you know how you whenever you start to stand up you can feel something like grab <sighs> it's heck getting old but yeah so I got that catch in my knee um, I was gonna say I was watching um, somebody that was talking about my eyelashes and uh, my eyelashes guys a lot of people ask me about my eyelashes I go have them done one lady was asking me if I would tell her about you know my eyelashes so um, I have them done I go to the salon and have them done well uh, my niece is a makeup consultant so she worked for Lexi which is the lady that owns the salon she owns um, the nails she owns that big salon the eyelash she does um, permanent uh, makeup she does all kinds of stuff in there and then next door she's got a beauty shop that does uh, feet hands hair all that stuff well she's pretty big she owns all that well my niece is a makeup consultant well she was working for her for a while um, doing her stuff in another little shop that she had open there 
and um, whenever I first went, so I got mine done for a hundred dollars for the first time. Hold on, guys, I have to shut my door. My son's having a cough attack. <coughs> now I'm having a cough attack. So anyway, I got mine done for the first time. She charged me a hundred dollars, which was half off, because she charges two hundred to do them for the first time. That's what you, you'd be charged for the first time is $200. Well, I go have mine filled every two weeks. So that's $60. If you go, if you go have them filled once a week, every week if you go have them filled, it's um, 45. If you go every two weeks to have them filled, it's 60. So, and I, it's cheaper, like, the longer you keep them on, it's cheaper. I think the most that you'll pay if you can even keep them on for a whole extra um, a month, it's like $80 to have them filled. But I always go every two weeks, so it's $60. So it costs me $100 to put them on, and then it costs me $60 every two weeks to have them filled. And um, I have had them where I took them all off before and then went back in to have them re-put back on and she always only charges me $100. So it's really not, it's not, it's expensive, yeah, but you know, um, I do a lot for other people so I thought, well I can, I can treat myself every now and then and this is something I really enjoy doing is doing my eyelashes. So, but if you ever have to take them off, go have them take them off. Because if you pull them off yourself, you will pull out your eyelashes. But they have it like this special stuff that they take them off with that where they'll, it'll slide it off of your eyelash without um, damaging your own eyelashes. I learned a hard lesson that way because when I first got them done, um, I hated them. I hated the way they look. I hated the way the girl did them. And I'd been going to her forever, just, you know, doing other stuff like my nails and stuff. And, um, I just think that she didn't have that much experience because she's super sweet. But, um, anyway, I hated them. So I went home and I pulled them off myself. And I did pull a lot of my own eyelashes out. So don't ever do that. Have them taken off if you ever have them on and you want to take them off. So, yeah, right. This is... Uh, Diane's Lash 101. So, I didn't mean it to turn into all that. I just wanted to say that um, it's not it's not going to cost you your uh, firstborn child or anything like that. But, anywho, that's my story on my eyelashes. And I hope that answered some questions because I have several people ask me about them. I'm sorry I spit on you. Uh, but, uh, Thanks again so much, guys. I appreciate y'all so, so much. And I love reading the comments. I lay here whenever we get all settled down and get cozy laying in my bed. And I'll put my glasses on with my little reading light and read all my comments and try to get in there and answer all of them. I did get one subscriber. Hear that plane? did get one subscriber tell me that, um that she is subscribed to several other people and that I never answer her comments and I'm so sorry so sorry that if you commented and I didn't answer it I apologize I try to either heart it or if I do miss your comments I'm sorry um, I don't do it intentionally I promise I try to answer everybody's, but sometimes it gets away from me. Like if I don't get on there and check them every single day, sometimes twice a day, I get behind. And then once I get behind, it's, you know, in my busy life, it's like I need to really sit down and take the time because you take the time to write them to me, so I should take the time to answer them. So I love y'all, and I appreciate y'all. I think I have another Timu order that's going to be delivered today. I hope it was, it set out for delivery yesterday, but we didn't get it yesterday. So it's supposed to be in today. I got several of them out there. They just are just trickling in. This one here 
was actually um, two, two teeny um, hauls. I've just been making little ones here and there, you know. So, anywho, and I'm going to get together all of my boxes for my giveaways. Um, it could be stuff from uh, the Dollar Tree, Timu, Shein, uh, the Family Dollar, the General Dollar. There's no telling what might be in your box or where from. But it'll be new, I promise. No used. So, anyway, saying that, I love and I appreciate y'all. One more time, I'm going to say it. I love and I appreciate y'all. And um, I'll be talking to you real soon. So, until then, bye for now.